1922. And um, in the 1960s, there was a population expansion. More people was moving to the island, so the government decided to build some affordable homes. Back in the 60s, you could get uh, um, back in the 60s, you could get a uh, two bedroom, one bath for about $65,000, um, a three bedroom, one bath for about $75,000. Today, that two bedroom uh, sell for about 250000 The three bedrooms sell for about two seventy-five to 350000 Some folks have turned their single family homes into multi-family homes and they sell from three seventy-five to four hundred and fifty thousand dollars. water on our right is the Atlantic Ocean. If you had to swim on Megan's Bay, one of the ten most beautiful beaches in the world, you'd be swimming in the Atlantic Ocean. Your ship is anchored in the Caribbean Sea. Now this island that you're looking at over there, it's Hans Lollick, Hans Lollick, and it's privately owned. The gentleman that purchased that island went to our Senate to get the zoning change from residential to commercial because he wanted to build a hotel and a resort on that island. But the nature lovers went and protested saying that there are wild birds and animals and the turtle lay the eggs on the beach and that island shouldn't be disturbed to build a hotel over there. Well, the nature love of one, the gentleman could build as much private homes as he wants, but he can't build a resort over in Hans Lolly. When we get to another point, you're going to get the opportunity to take some pictures of that area over there. I was thinking, I could make my own side, but that would be pretty at the water. Now, if you look here in this yard here on the left, you'll see a home built out of that blue bit rock that I talked about. That's good plywood, you know, and, and, and paint. Is that a metal roof? No, wood made out of. Yeah. Plywood roof? That's what you said. Plywood. Yeah. 